Hey guys, what's up? It's Josh. So for today's video, as you guys can see by the title, I wanted to talk about six different things attractive girls do differently. There's so many different things out there that I have told you guys about before and things that I've mentioned in other videos about all of the little things that you girls do that you don't realize you're doing that are actually super attractive to a guy. So in today's video, I just wanted to talk about like what attractive people do compared to like what people might find to be not attractive. So if you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure that you give it a thumbs up. Also, before I start today's video, now, today's video is sponsored by White with Style. One of the questions that I get all the time is how do I keep my teeth white? How do I whiten my teeth? What the heck do I use to whiten my teeth? So today I got a brand new package. I'm gonna open this and show you guys exactly what's in here, how I use it, and how often I use it. So when you open the bag, you get a bunch of different things in it. You're gonna get the teeth whitening trays, which you have to form it to your mouth. Then you also get the teeth whitening gel. This is the stuff that you put in the mouth trays that actually makes your teeth white. And then the coolest part is the light. So when you have the teeth whitening gel and the trays in your mouth you put this light on to like activate the gel while it's in there and that's what helps it like speed up the process of making your teeth white so one thing that I was always concerned about when I started to whiten my teeth was like is it gonna make my teeth sensitive is it gonna hurt my gums and after using white with style because it's all vegan it's FDA registered it's cruelty free it makes your teeth ten shades whiter and it's like gluten free and all that stuff but I've never had any teeth sensitivity or had my gums hurt at all cool thing about white with style as well is that they have so many different flavors so you can get mint, you can get cotton candy. They even have flavors like birthday cake and like blue raspberry. So when you put it in your mouth, it actually tastes really good. And you only have to do it for half an hour. So it's not like you're doing it for like hours at a time. If you guys want to check it out, I will have it down in the description. It's uh, $28 to get this if you use my code. Originally, it's like $300. So make sure that you guys check it out. Use my code. Go and try it. Let me know what you think. But with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. And here are six different things that you attractive girls do differently. <laughs> so the first thing that I think is attractive is when somebody is not always complaining about their body. I feel like if a guy is with you and he's like, he legit is wanting to go on dates with you, he's hanging out with you, he's like telling you that he likes you. I think sometimes we just need to like take a step back and realize that if we're hanging out with somebody and they really enjoy being with us, that we shouldn't be like sitting there complaining about things that we don't like about ourselves because that person likes us the way that we are. So one thing that I think is kind of like hard for everybody, it doesn't matter who you are, when you go on social media, you see everybody's lives. And I feel like that obviously has a negative impact on the way that I think sometimes we look at ourselves and the things that we're doing. Now without social media and all that stuff, I think that like a lot of people would have a different outlook and be happier because they're not comparing themselves to other people all the time. But I think that we need to like kind of take a step back every once in a while and realize that we are our own person. Like, we shouldn't be trying to compare ourselves to anybody else. And I feel like guys, we do that just as much as you, like girls do. Like I feel like guys complain about everything. <laughs> so I would say like as the first one, a guy or a girl, doesn't matter who you are. I think that it's an attractive quality and something that separates you from everybody else when you are not always comparing like your body or whatever it is to other people. All right, so the next type of like quality, I guess you could call it in a person that I think majority of people find attractive is when somebody doesn't take themselves too seriously. If you can find somebody that like when they screw up, they're not like totally down on themselves and like stressed out and just hate themselves. They're able to just like laugh it off and realize that they made a mistake or they did something wrong. Those are the types of people that I feel like are the ones that make you happier. Like when you're with somebody that that, like learns from their mistakes and realizes that like they're not gonna do everything perfect in life so yeah I feel like within guys and girls that's like another quality if you're able to just laugh at stuff and get over it <laughs> then I feel like that's something that people are attracted to all right so moving on to the third one which I kind of like I was thinking about this one for a little bit I wasn't sure if I was gonna put this in here but it's definitely something that I think people find to be attractive and that's when somebody has like a crazy passion for something not only is it that they're like doing something something that they're passionate about, but it's also like putting into your mind that like we should be motivated to go and find something that we're passionate about. So yeah, I feel like it's just an attractive quality and something that we just always look for in other people. So if you can find it and you can find those people, I think that that's a really good thing. <laughs> All right, so the fourth one, I think that this one is important because if you're hanging out with people, one thing that you really need and something that I think everybody, like everybody at some point needs this is just like somebody who's really encouraging and pushes you to 
do the things that like you should be doing. And I feel like it's just another one of those things of like surrounding yourself with people that you wanna either be like or people that are just pushing you in the right direction. So I feel like with attractiveness, sometimes we only think about like what we see on the outside, but when you actually think about it, I think there's a lot more to that and there's a lot more of just like looking at how somebody is as a person that like if they can be encouraging and help you through whatever it is that you're trying to do, that's one of the most attractive qualities. All right, the last one that I wanna to talk to you guys about, I wasn't sure how I was gonna word it because it's just like when you meet one of those people that they never talk bad about anybody else. Like they're such a nice person that they are only talking about the good qualities and like what they're proud of in other people. I feel like it's just rare. And when you like think about it now with everybody comparing themselves on social media, it's so easy to wanna like not be confident in yourself and then tear down other people because you don't have that self-confidence. Whereas that attractive quality of like still being able to push through that and just like talk about people's good qualities. It's just like one of those qualities that is super attractive in another person. And yeah, I feel like that's all I have to say about that one. <laughs> so yeah, those are the five different ones that I wanted to talk to you guys about today. I just wanted to kind of like talk about those attractive qualities that a lot of people have and that maybe we don't really think about all the time. If you guys enjoyed today's video, give it a thumbs up. If you guys check out White With Style, let me know down in the comments. Let me know what you think of it on your teeth and like if you notice a difference in your teeth. Also, if you have a question or you want me to answer or something or you want me to make a video about something leave it down in the comments also if you don't follow me on Instagram that's where I answer so many of you guys' DMs it's unreal like I go through every day in the morning and just try to like write as many as I can out to you guys and try to answer questions on there as much as I can so if you don't follow me on the vlog channel you guys can go over there and do that but with that being said hope you guys enjoyed today's video I love you guys so much and as always, I will see you next Saturday in next week's video. Bye!